Armitage Armitage is a GUI interface for Metasploit. Armitage allows you easily scan hosts for vulnerabilities and exploit these vulnerabilities with only a few clicks. This video is going to be very special. In this video, we are going to scanning vulnerability using Armitage. Vulnerability scanning using Armitage. Our goal, scan the Metasploitable host for vulnerabilities and exploit one of these vulnerabilities to gain access to the machine. Step 1. Start the Metasploitable server by clicking on the virtual box icon and select. Select the Metasploitable virtual machine and press the play button. Step 2. Click on the Armitage icon. Actually, this is not now available on the latest Kali, so you have to install it. To install Armitage just type in the command, apt get install Armitage. To run type, Armitage. Step 3, you should see the setup screen. Click connect. Step 4, if you get a pop-up asking you to start Metasploit RPC server. Click yes. Armitage communicates with Metasploit using the RPC server. If you get this pop-up I cannot find a database.yml file. Really need an open terminal and type msfdb in it. It may take a couple of seconds. All, all done. Now we are going to run again. For running Armitage, run these two commands. One is postcar SQL start. FDB start. If everything is working, well you should get the following screen. This is the Armitage GUI. Now let's take a tour. It is divided into three parts. The center part is used to visualize the target. Down here is console. Every command will appear here. On the left side, here is a module that consists of an auxiliary module, exploit module, payloads, post. Step 5. Once you have successfully set up Armitage, you will need to discover the machines that you would like to scan for vulnerabilities. You can do this using the Net Discover tool from Lab1. Or you can use the Armitage Discovery tool. Click on Hosts, Scan, then Quick Scan. Step 6. To ensure that we don't attack uninterrupted machines on our network we will manually add the IP address our Metasploitable machine to our Armitage workspace. You will get a pop-up that asks you for the range of IP addresses that you want scan. This takes IP address in Cedar notation. For example, 192.168.56.100.24 IP version 4 address is a 32-bit address. This notation means that you should keep the first 24 bits static and vary the remaining 8 bits to search for hosts. Enter the following IP address range in the box. Your IP address 24. Remember from the first lab that it is possible to get your IP address by running the IP config command. Once your scan has completed you notice the too many target icon will appear with their IP address. Now I don't want all these target, so I want to clear the targets, so click on hosts and clear the database. We have already known our IP address, I want to check the operating system used in that target machine. So click on host, scan then quick scan, OS detect.
Once your scan has completed you notice that Armitage has discovered the Metasploitable host. Step 7. Now that we have discovered some hosts and some open ports the ports. Let's scan them for vulnerabilities. Click on the host that you want to scan. Be highlighted by a green box. Then click on attacks then find attacks. Step 8. Once vulnerability scan has completed you will see the exploitable vulnerabilities by right clicking on the host and selecting attacks. You can try any of these attacks. Exploiting a host using Armitage. Step 1. Click on the FTP attack. This will show you a description of the attack. When Armitage attacks a host it uploads a payload that allows you to control the host. This payload needs to be configured so that it can connect to your machine so you can control it and in turn control the infected host. Each parameter in the table is explained as L host, the IP address of the controlling machine. L port, the port on the controlling machine. R host, the IP address of the host being attacked. R port, the port used by the payload in a reverse connection. The attacked host will start the connection. Step 2. Click Launch to launch the attack. Once your host is comprised the host icon will change to like this. Step 3. You can now get shell access on the machine by right clicking on the host and selecting shell 1. Interact. A Linux shell will appear in the bottom section of Armitage. Step 4. You should terminal open up at the bottom of the window. Type the ls command in this window. Fix. The way to prevent attacks like the one above is to ensure that your software always updates. So that the system does not contain any known vulnerabilities. If you like my video then subscribe to my YouTube channel to get more videos on ethical hacking, web development, and programming videos. Stay connected with us.